will be heading out of town for Memorial Day. Experts say you may find yourself on some of the busiest highways and flights seen in decades. News 19's Lindsay Smith joins us in the studio now. And Lindsay, what can people expect as they travel on the highway this weekend? Tamika Ben, AAA says an estimated 43.8 million people across the U.S. will likely travel this Memorial Day holiday weekend. The association says you can expect a lot of congestion on the roadways this weekend, along with airports that could be even more crowded than in years past. The unofficial start to summer is just a few days away, and AAA expects a major weekend for air travel and road trips this Memorial Day. We think it will be uh, very close to the busiest Memorial Day weekend of all time, which was in 2005, when we had 44 million. According to the association, most people will start their holiday weekend on Thursday. It's going to be busy on, on the roads. It's going to be really busy in the airports. For those planning to hit the road or board a plane this weekend, here's what you need to know. Airports across the country are bracing for another spike in travelers. You might want to get there three, three and a half hours early, maybe, rather than the standard two hours early, just to be sure you don't don't miss out. And if you're traveling on the roads, prepare to hit traffic. Ingram recommends avoiding speeding and mm -hmm. weaving in and out of traffic. We did a study a couple years ago that showed that you could save as much as 33% of your fuel expense by switching from As the official lawn care treatment provider of the PGA Tour, we know what it takes to get a pro-level lawn. Precision. Drive. Travel experts say the Memorial Day holiday weekend will be just a snapshot of what's to come for the busy summer season. 22 News reporter Christina DeMore spoke with those experts about what you can expect as you book your plans. The travel demand is high this summer. AAA says the sooner you book, the better. Whether it's a road trip over state lines, I'll be going to New Hampshire in a few weeks, or this an international excursion. Mm -hmm. I'm also visiting Spain and Morocco. Big travel plans are happening this summer, and experts say be prepared because it's going to be busier than ever with more cars on roads and congested security lines at airports. I try to have like a mindset of it's going to be crazy, and that's how travel goes, you know, and then when you get there, you can rest. Summer travel is already soaring for this Memorial Day weekend, AAA projecting about 44 million travelers, which is the second highest traveling forecast for Memorial Day weekend since 2000 really clear indicator that we're going to have a really strong summer. AAA experts say high demand and inflation will cause some sticker shock for those looking to book everything from hotels and dining to rental That's cars okay. and airfare. Uh -huh. They say while your dollar may go further See, overseas compared to the prices overflow. in the U.S., you should Thank book you. now for the best deals. I think there are some places where prices are going to be more reasonable, mm. but we're seeing price increases of anywhere from 5 to 15 or even 30 percent. In some really popular locations. Well, we have Still busy busy all time, to utilize travel no, agents no, to find no, those best deals. And in the event of delays or cancellations, travel oh. insurance can Instead also help. Head chair, to our website, wwlp.com, no. where you can see the best going. times to hit the roads That's for right. Memorial That's Day well weekend. Reading. Working for you, Christina DeMores, Twenty. Memorial Day weekend is expected to be one of the busiest travel weekends in nearly two decades, Especially according to now. AAA. So when is the best time saying? to avoid mm -hmm. the roads? Especially Jen now. Sullivan has tips for travelers. If you're joining or flying this Memorial Thank Day you. weekend, expect plenty of company on the roads and in the skies. We're expecting the second busiest Memorial Day weekend of air travel since we started tracking at the beginning of the century. AAA estimates nearly 44 million people will travel 50 miles or more this holiday weekend. That's a 4% increase from last year. Most people will be driving to their destination, with more than 38 million drivers expected to be on the roads. So when's the best time to avoid the traffic we see the busiest times to be on the road is thursday and friday evenings when you've got the travelers mixing in with the regular commuters hitting out before 11 a.m on thursday or after 7 p.m on friday and returning home after 7 p.m on monday night is the best time to be driving and when it comes to gas prices they expect to pay slightly more this year the national average price for a regular gallon of gas as of monday was three dollars and 59 cents according to AAA. that's about five cents higher than this time last year if you're driving it's not just your tank you should check folks should check their tire pressure make sure 
monitor everything in their cars and working order before you set out on a long road trip. Airports will likely see a spike in travelers, too. More than three and a half million people will be flying. It's expected to be the most crowded Memorial Day weekend at airports since 2005. So give yourself plenty of time to check in and get their security. For Consumer Watch, I'm Jen Sullivan.